Now that I've been in the Stefani song. But anyway, um, so I caught this movie called Faults. And it's where these uh, people who deal with cults, one of the things they try to do is um, what's called uh, I'm doing the brainwashing or something like that. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, most people it's called deprogramming, that's right. But anyway, mm -hmm. now the problem with most cults, like I said, is they try to isolate you from your family and friends and get you to become part of their understanding of, say, the Bible or a religious idea or something of that nature. Mm -hmm. Now, the problem with some cults is you don't even know if, you know, your own shipmates are part of the church, right? Right. <laughs> well, these people I ran into, I would say, mm -hmm, kind of do the same thing. Right. The thing about brainwashing someone is they're reading portions of the Bible too, right? and not the rest. <laughs> Damn. See, they'll tell you about mm, certain things. But they won't tell you about certain things as well mm -hmm. that are also in the Bible. Mm -hmm. The reason might be, mm -hmm. ooh, there we go. Another skating program today at four. Mm -hmm. I can record that. Mm -hmm. All right, but anyway, mm -hmm. it was in everyone's best interest, not mine, especially yours. How did you get out of the bathroom? Claire. Teleporting? How did you get out of the bathroom? Come sit next to me. <laughs> no. I can't. Please. Hmm. Now, no, in the movie, however she got out of the bathroom, she's not in the bathroom. <laughs> Are there windows in the bathroom now? I'm scared. The second you left, you what? left me. When it got dark out, they put me in there and locked the door. I felt like you had abandoned me. seeing things from a set of eyes other than my own. I haven't thought much about the group. That's good to hear. But when you left, I didn't know what to do. And I started praying in there. I started to pray, and then prayer turned to meditation, and I don't know. myself. I imagined myself stepping outside of Claire's body and being able to see in a way I'd never seen before. Something told me to walk through the bathroom door, so I did. Mm -hmm. It opened. I walked through the door. And I was in the room. I could see my parents sleeping, but I knew that even if they woke up, they wouldn't see me. I knew I was beyond being seen. I stayed there for a moment watching them. But something didn't feel right. I felt like I was being pulled back towards Claire. I reached the front door and stepped through it as well. But it didn't feel the same. It hurt. I felt 
come to the ground on the other side. I've moved up the level and so. <laughs> so here's the thing. They put her in the bathroom, but they found her outside, huh? And <laughs> Don't forget, it's part of the movie. But the implication is, what? Teleportation? Yeah, yeah. I let God do all the work. <laughs> it needs to do the home. Did you hear me? From now on, she's not to be left alone. Someone always has to be with her. Is something wrong? Yes. I'm not sure. I just... I feel the best thing to do right now is... We need to make sure we don't lose her. We're so close. And I need the rest of the payment. What did you just ask me? I need the money, Paul. Not until she's clear. Yeah. I hired you to fix her. I can't guarantee anything, Paul. It's not all up to me in this. There are other factors at play. I want the money now. I don't trust you. I don't trust any of this. Everything is... And I have to look out for myself. This is about my daughter. Get her back to me. She needs to be... Oh! Daddy, stop! Uh, I think I don't know what goes on behind that door. Do you think I'm stupid? No! But see, you know me simplicating such so, things. So. <laughs> and the don't look like the dad's all there either, does it? Nope. <laughs> See, that's the rating boards, right? When you let people censor you, because mm -hmm, they're easily offended by words they're afraid their children will hear. Though you're going to hear it, your parents say it in their own home, because their children are going to say it, right? That's your problem. <laughs> That's the point, too. It's the premise of what the movie is really about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it's real implications, right? She's naked, she's naked. <laughs> but do you still have shame? Either Jesus died for his sins to forgive you your sins, or he didn't. Yeah. 
young teacher, the subject of school girl fantasy. Uh oh. She wants him. He's not supposed to do that if he's the program. Is he? Is he? See, I'm dealing with a, something of a sexual nature, but also a corrupting nature. Condemned. Heard that before. Heard that before. <laughs> I'm the sole surviving member of the universal concurrence after Sunday's terrible tragedy in which 36 people ritualistically killed themselves under the command of their leader. Jennifer, we were talking about the concurrence, or your family as, as you like to call them. I guess my question is this. How could anyone allow something like this to happen to their family? Do you feel any sense of responsibility? I didn't think this was going to happen, not like... Oh, hmm. Interesting, huh? Something like this could happen, yes. But I don't think I ever thought it really would. When I helped you leave the group, you told me that you were going to be naked, right? Because I'm going to blow her in the mouth, right? Because you're going to be naked, right? Because I'm going to blow her in the mouth, right? You're blacking out. You're blacking out. <laughs>
Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thinking about liking someone again. Right. Mm-hmm. I'll take to one mistake. Remember, I was getting my mouth all house and then wonder why. So, like I say, mm -hmm. when you don't know people's motive and they're more sexual than you're used to, <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> well, like I said, I don't remember none of that with my earner David. And I know we're trying to date, and to me, they're hooking up more than I am. <laughs> I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> I see, I was trying to wait for marriage, and they were trying to wait for marriage. Why did they No, no. Myself, myself. But I'm not mad about it. That I didn't either. <laughs> I didn't mind being with the women. <laughs> it was how they were coming to me. Yeah, I know. No, I met them at the normal place, the club, or. <laughs> right? USO. <laughs> yeah, every woman at the USO is trying to sleep with you. In the Navy. <laughs> huh. Uh huh. Yeah, the, again, convenience store. <laughs> and of course, a party with some friends. My cousin, <laughs> Jay and his girlfriend, and Judy, and of course, I still didn't know that. <laughs> and then the, Okay, she goes off of me, <laughs> and mm -hmm. <laughs> and we have sex. We have sex, <laughs> right? <laughs> She's playing the stripper <laughs> to me and Uncle Russell. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. But I accept it. <laughs> so I don't look like a gift horse in the mouth. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> Then, mm -hmm, right. Um, the last girl before she then was the um, again I met her at the club and got her number and things like that. Right, usually right. <laughs> I don't know. Then I told you, um, the other women I met at the club, right. One I met at the, <laughs> oops, um, two I met walking the, um, front of the base, right, as you leave the gates, right, and there's two entrances, so it was past the entrance, um, where you can just go out, mm -hmm. um, one I think I'm at the Taco Bell. <laughs> Yo quiero Taco Bell. <laughs> anyway. And uh, the other one picked me up somewhere. Mm -hmm. And then, like I said, the last one was at the um, tag office to get into the base and stuff like that. <sighs> but see, like I said, <laughs> Just accepting what comes my way and not looking to give horse in the mouth. Mm -hmm. But not judging. Just needing somebody. You know. Temporarily, even. And, uh, more in line with Samson, I think. <laughs> mm hmm. Because I feel like. Someone's trying to make me something I don't want to do, right? 
And I'm asking about it, but not into it. Mm -hmm. But they tell me the price of doing that. <laughs> if you understand. <laughs> and again, mm -hmm. like I said, McDonald's, 37th Street. <laughs> I'm at Daphne on base at Port Smith. All right. Right, meet Mary Bell in the Burger King. <laughs> the niece I met meet taking Roddy to one of his appointments. Right, and Molly I meet online, and she comes allegedly from San Francisco, I guess. Right, and yeah, <laughs> and Michelle I met with little Roddy at Donna's house. Right, because she was and Donna were friends. Right. I hooked up with Michelle, but it was like two weeks apart, right? But both times we're at Donna's house, right? Then I kind of break up with her. Are you out of control here? Right. 